30 easy ways to introduce topics that work both in online Zoom classes and in real regular classes. Uh, number one, spell the word F-A-N. Fa. Spell the phonic. F ox. Fox. Number three, slow reveal. What's this? Flag. Correct. Describe the word. Uh, it's pink. It's a big bird. It stands on one leg. A flamingo. Flamingo. The students describe to you. It is green. Mm -hmm. It can jump. Kangaroo. Gesture. What's this? I don't know. It's a flower. Uh, do the sound. What's this? Monkey. Yes. Or you can use an app. What's this? A sheep. Yes. Guess the cards you're holding. Uh, tell me words that start with P. Pig. Yes. Popcorn. Yes. Pizza. Yes, pizza. Uh, find the cards in the room. Uh, in class, you can just hide them around the room and they can look for them. In Zoom classes, you can connect your camera to the Zoom so your camera becomes, your phone becomes like a, a roving camera and you can kind of look around the room and find stuff. Slow draw. What's this? It's a pig. Multiple slow draw. What's this? When a kid guesses, you can finish the picture. Oh, it's a cat. Yes, it's a cat. It's got, yes. Mouth the word, make no sound. What's this? Panda? Close. Spanda. Spider. Uh, say a sentence with a word missing. Uh, I went to the restaurant and I ate a... Pizza. Yes. Uh, tell me some animals that live in the sea. Dolphin. Uh, can you tell me some other animals? I can't draw a dolphin. Um, octopus. Uh, read a story. Just read a story that has the words you want to teach. For example, this is a teddy bear book. Uh, it's about a teddy bear that uh, they find in the trash. And they put its eyes back on, its nose, its mouth, its ears, its arms, its legs, and then they have a teddy bear. That introduces a whole bunch of words like body, but this book, if you read it backwards, then you start ripping off his legs, you rip off his arms, you rip off his ears, you rip off his mouth, his nose, his eyes, and then you throw him in the trash. And some kids think that's great, and some kids get really angry. Uh, song. Uh, change the lyrics of a song to anything you want. If you sing the song loud enough, then you can change any words. We have a song, uh, Everybody Freeze. It goes, everybody's walking, everybody's walking, 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 everybody freeze. Change the lyrics to something else. Uh, everyone's a pig, everyone's a pig, 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 pig everybody freeze. Uh, say the words you're trying to teach very, very quickly and see if they can catch them. Ready? Triangle, tree, tomato, train, toilet. Triangle. Uh, zoom in on a picture and uh, see if they can guess what it is. Uh, this works much easier online, but you can do it with an iPad. So, what's this? It's a pig. Uh, what's missing? Um, show all the words. We have rocket, robot, reindeer, rainy, and rainbow. Take one away. Which one's missing? Rockets. Correct. Next. Which two are missing? Timer, uh, how fast can they say all the cards? Uh, for example, go. Triangle train, what's that? Say, I don't know. If they don't know it, they say, I don't know, and then count to 10. Triangle train, I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Tomato tree, popcorn, pig, pineapple, piano, pizza. Yes. Actually, don't make them count to 10, make them count to 12, because it's harder. Uh, mystery bag. Uh, what's inside the mystery bag? Uh, you can do the shape. Can you guess what that is? A pig. 
No, it is pink though. What do you think it is? Rabbit. No. It's a beautiful bird. Flamingo. It is the most beautiful flamingo in the world. Students try to find the word in a picture. Uh, like in Where's Wally? So, uh, something like this. Uh, can you find the heart? Over here. Uh, gesture copy, uh, you make some gestures or you ask them for gestures and you kind of try to make it as long as you can uh, doing the gestures. Uh, for example, uh, pig. Pig. Okay. Pig, pig, cat. Pig, pig, cat. Okay. Pig, pig, cat. Uh, get the students to draw a picture of the card. Uh, for example, draw a spider. Make it more interesting, add some adjectives. Uh, tell me, stop. Stop! Draw a heavy spider. Play a concentration or a match too. Uh, you know, you get two copies of each card and they have to flip over the cards to match too. Uh, this works incredibly well online. Um, you can see our other videos on how to set it up on a virtual whiteboard. Uh, watch a video. Um, you can do this easily online. Uh, in class, if you have an iPad, you can maybe upload the video or connect it to YouTube and you can watch a video together and uh, you can talk about what you see and introduce the topics. Uh, you can totally play bingo to introduce uh, words. Uh, in class, it's much easier than online because you can just hand out the bingo cards. Online, if you post them the bingo cards or get them to print out or, or even just make the bingo cards in class, although that might be a bit of a waste of time, but you can play it in both ways. Uh, multiple hangman. This is better and more fun and more useful than normal hangman. You put all the words together and you play them all at the same time. So I'm teaching uh, phonics for cap, lap, map, uh, jam, ram, ham, dam, nap. So if someone chooses C, well I know there's a C on cap. If someone chooses A, then I put in for all of the A's. Someone chooses P, then I know P, 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 P. And you can kind of teach as you go, app, 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 app. You can teach the phonics. It's a bit more useful and certainly a lot faster than normal hangman where you're just doing one word at a time. Uh, finally, categories. If you don't know categories, the game is you ask the students to draw as many things as they can in 30 seconds of a topic. For example, draw as many farm animals as you can in 30 seconds. Go. For each picture they draw that's correct, they get one point. So she just drew a cow, a pig, and a sheep. That's worth three points. One, two, three. I drew a pig, a chicken, and a helicopter. That's worth two points because a helicopter is not a farm animal. If you draw a picture that no one else draws, you get two points or you get a bonus point. So I drew a chicken. No one else drew a chicken. So this is worth two points. This is worth one point. This is worth zero points. Total three points. She drew a cow, no one else drew a cow, two points. The sheep, no one else drew a sheep, two points, four points. And the pig is worth one point. So five points, three points. Uh, I would make it like 30 seconds, 40 seconds at most because otherwise the game can take really, really long time. And if you're in Japan, don't let them use erasers because they will take hours to draw a picture. Uh, so those are 30 games that work in both online classes and real classes. Uh, if you have any more games, please comment and I'll add them to the description. And uh, yeah, please like, subscribe and all that stuff.